a YouTube HDR inside Darktable. Let's do this. When I started using Darktable a few months ago, I realized there was a button named Create HDR. The problems with that button are that it doesn't do alignment and it only support raw files. I like landscape photography so even if I'm shooting on a tripod, my picture are almost never aligned because of wind and vibrations. I've tried to do the alignment outside of Darktable before doing the merge but it doesn't work because the button only takes raw files. And as a result, this button is completely useless for me, but no worries, I have a solution. But before we do anything, we have to make sure Darktable is well configured. It won't take you more than 5 minutes and you only have to do it once. We will be using a virtual machine running Linux Mint 22.1. I don't know if this works on Macs or Windows. Maybe. If it doesn't, you just have to switch to Linux. The first step is to make sure Darktable is installed as a system package. If you install it as a flat pack, you will only experience pain and suffering. Next, make sure that the git package is installed because we need it to install the script module. We also have to install a package called HDR Merge. So this is the software Darktable will use in the background to align and merge the HDR. This software is great and I recommend you go on their website to read about it. Now it's time to fire up Darktable and once open, go on the bottom left, click on Lua Script Installer and then on Execute. If you did not install Git, this will not work. Now you need to import a collection because the script will not load if there isn't any pictures in the library. To load the script, go to the bottom left, make sure you are in the Contributed folder Go to page 3 and enable HDR Merge. On the right side panel, you will now see a new module called HDR Merge. Open it and click on the folder to open the file browser. We need to tell Darktable where to find the binary file. In the file browser, navigate to forward slash bin and search for HDR Merge. Once you find it, click on update. Now, select the picture you want to use to create an HDR and click on Merge. And voila! We have our final image that was aligned and stacked inside Darktable using the HDR Merge plugin. We can now do our final edit and post it on social media so our moms can like it. I hope this video was helpful for you, so if it was, uh, just give me a like and see you next time.